So hello my guys welcome back to our YouTube channel my name is ha Mike the Hat Healer na kama uje subscribe subscribe so leo tuko na ngeo sapa hivi leo anatuambia zile challenges amekuwa akipitia kama mangeos ana represent mangeos wote hapo nje so leo ako na deep secret ameamua kutuambia eh so acha tusikiane tu nani asome wapi na ana plan aje kwa maisha so mambo Unaitwa nani? Naitwa Zainab. Zainab. So Zainab unasoma ama ama ikoaje? Nasomea computer sasa hivi. Unasomea computer sasa hizi? So tukikuja hapa hivi umetuambia uko na customer tu kadogo ungependa kuinspire mtu pale nje. So nikikuja uliniambia wewe ni single single ume raise na single parent. So tuko tunataka tujue ni aje ili happen baka ukajipata ukiraise uki na single parent. Nili happen. Okay. Hmm. Squeeze relationship mingi hmm. watu usafa wazazi mm. unakosa nanga kwa ajili ya vitu kidogo tu mm. unapata mzazi ana kukuelewana sasa huyo mm -hmm. mzazi tuseme ana mzazi yani tuseme mbaba ko into drugs mm -hmm. haya so unapata sometimes hawaelewani mm -hmm. alafu inakuwa huyo mm -hmm. mzee anakasilika alafu anafukuza baba ama mm. anafukuza mama unakuwa uko single parent mm. sasa inabidi mm. ulelewe na mzazi mmoja mm -hmm. kwa sababu sometimes squeeze ukilelewa na mama wa nje mm -hmm. akutunzi mama wa kambo akunini akutunzi vizuri mm. na kuna challenges basi mm. ndio maana mimi nimelelewa mimi mm. nimelelewa na single parent mm. na I'm happy for that mm. na penda mama wangu hadi mm. akiniona hapo kwa youtube mm. na mwambia nampenda sana mm. yeah so like hii situation yako uli tuseme ni walikuwa nagombana ni dad na mama walikuwa wagombana ama ilienda aje ama ni ama ilikuwa aje yeah walikuwa wanagombana sana mm. yeah so na nikaweza kuuliza like kwa family yenu mlikuwa watoto wangapi we are kind of three mm. two boys mm. one girl mm. Mm. so hiyo siku wenye dad na mama waliamua ku separate ulikuwa how old i was like i was too young mm. nilikuwa mdogo sana mm. yeah So hiyo siku hata ungeza kujua ni ni, ni venye mama na safa ama ulikuwa unaona venye na safa like unajua sasa like dad na mama wakiwa hapo wana join efforts ndio yeah. so like mtu mmoja akitoka either either dad ama mom mm. unapata effort imerudi chini so unapata huo mwenye ameacho lazima ajitume sana yeah. na cheki mm. so kulienda aje dad alichukua sam ama mama alichukua sam ama mlilelewa na mama peke yake. Hey, mama ni ametulea peke yake ndio maana maana nasema mm. sasa hii wazazi mm. mama mwenye penye ako mm. sasa hii mama ni yeye anafaa chukua heshima yote kabisa. Mm. Yeah. So na like venye dada alienda ashai ulizi ya story kwa usu huwa anawatembelea ama kitu kama hiyo. Kuuliza huwa anauliza lakini kutembea hapana. Huwa mm. atembei mm. ajui home ama anajua ama nikukataa ama ajui. Mm. Mm. We sasa venye dad dad alienda yeah. so mama aliye uh, kuliendaje mama alipata another man unajua kuna hii pia sasa hizi tumeona tuseme kama mtu ni single parent tunapata mzazi wake amepata effort nyingine na wameweza kukaa pamoja like mama yako ama ni yetu peke yake ama Ya, yeah, huo mm. wanakuja lakini lazima huo wanakosana kwa ajili mm. mm. hakuna relationship huo ina last long sana. Mm. Mm. Wanakaa like one year, two years mm. wanakosana. Mm. Yeah. So ame ame nini amepata pata effort kidogo but wanakosana, yeah. si ndio? Yeah. So umeniambia bado hajafika 18, si ndio? Yeah. So pale hivi kuna dem mm. ako pale hivi anajichukia na sema like hii familia yetu sijui na kuangaje mbona mimi single parent unapata kuna stress so utamwambiaje venye umeweza kukop up na hiyo stress baka saa hizi bado unaendelea na life vizuri okay mimi nitamwambia sisikie venye watu wanamwambia mm. endelee tu na life yake focus tu na maisha yake peke yake mm. yeah so saa hizi umetuambia unafanya nini saa hizi like uko shule ama yeah nasoma computer mm. yeah Alafu okay. mm. alafu nikimaliza kusoma computer nisome mm. beauty. Mm. So wewe kwa maisha yako eh yeah? nataka kuadvise pale ule msichana wako pale. Mm. Nataka mwambie kuhusu wewe sio una venye life ya marriage iko. Yeah. Wewe unaweza taka kuolewa ukiona how many years obviously una struggles za marriage. Yeah. Marriage si kwenda kucheka si ndio? Yeah. So wewe unapangaje kuhusu na marriage? Una plan aje? Okay mtu asikimbilie marriage yoyote mimi mm -hmm. kuolewa naweza olewa like 25 years mm -hmm. na siwezi kimbilia mm. yeah ndio utaambia je mademo nyoko pale nje sasa hizi wanakula tu raha si ndio mm. unapata wa, yani wanafanya vitu zingine kwa sababu mimi bado hajafikisha 18 yeah. acha tutaenda deep sana so like kuna wa madem 
unapata tu wana role na maboy boy boy unapata at the age of 19 18 17 amepata ball sasa ni tamaa ya inakoga nao madem ama ni self control ama ni peer pressure wewe una aje pressure mm. sana sana ni peer pressure kwa jia ataona rafiki yake anafanya hivi mm. na yeye asikie tamaa afanye hivyo to the same thing mm. yeah so madem so kama uko hapo hivyo so kama uko hapo hivyo sikia advice ya msichana yes kwa 17 years unaweza kuwa uko 25 but venye na reason na venye na reason ni totally different so like umeniambia like sasa hizi mtu amekuja amekupea ball yeah. utaanza wapi Okay hadi mimi mwenyewe sijizielewa mm. kwa ji first of all kitu nyenye nitafikiria tu nitafikiria tu kutoa hiyo ball mm. yeah so wewe utafikiria kutoa ball yeah so na like itakuwa mzuri itakuwa mzuri by the way mm. Mm. so like hii kuna jo kuna issue nyingine tunasikiaga dem amekuja ametuambia like it was an accident Wana believe kuna ball ya kupata na accident. Ah yeah, ah. Uh, Sini mm. alienda akafanya hiyo kitu na mm. ni Sini walifanya hiyo kitu so ni must wapitie tu hiyo nini. Mm. Yeah. So wana sema madem wenye size wako pregnant ama wenye wako na watu hii na walipata wakio age, age kiasi wanafaa wana deserve. Ama ama unajaribu kumaanisha nini? So umesema au ndio walienda huko so wanafaa kukapitia. Ama una maanishaje? Unajua mtu mm. akienda kufanya hiyo kitu anafaa kwa kifikilia. Mm. Unajua ni nini unaendea kwa huyo mwanaume. Mm. Yeah. So watu wache uh, sana sana madem wache pia pressure nini ya sex, ndio? Yeah. So madem msikia venye dem wenzenyu wamesema hapa hivi si, sisi si, tumesema na unaweza ambia je boys wenye wana impregnant uh, wana impregnant nini like young women ama young girls. Okay. Mimi mm. kwangu mimi nitasema mm achunge huo mtoto angalie age sana mm. sana mm. unaweza pata huo mse ako mm. 17 18 mm. lakini bado ni mdogo bado mm. ajapitia hiyo time ya ku, mm. ku, nini kuanza kulea mtoto ajajua mm. kwa jinsi hii tukiona mm. watu, watoto wengi hawajui kulea mm. Wan, wanalea watoto wenzao mm. eh hivyo ndo huko sasa so au maboy wenye mnapena mimba then mnatoroka so manze skeni to advice ujue once umepena ball umearibia huo msichana maisha yake labda kwao hawajakaa poa unapata msichana huko nje anafanya kazi na mtu yuko mgongo wewe uko huko tu bado unaendelea kwenda maform raha raha unasema madema jaisha so my boys manze eh hey, najua tunajifanya gawajanja but recent hizi vitu hazifurahishi umesikia venye demo amesema amekuwa raised na single parent na si mom si ati mom ndio alitoka ni dad ndio alitoka na cheki so tafadhali mjaribu kurekebisha hapo hivyo maboys eh, so imekuwa the heart healer umesikia kwa story so kama unapitia story yote kama hiyo na unataka kushare so unaweza tu comment hapo chini na kama je subscribe subscribe ndio hata tukiende hiyo episode nyingine ujue so kila kitu takuwa tupo manzi so thank you thank you